Welcome back you guys. Today we're going over chapter 12 now. So now you have Israel is divided. We have Boom, which is Solomon's son, is in charge of Israel and where the temple is built and where King David's house is. So, Rehoboam is, is um, Solomon's son and in charge of Israel and doesn't listen to the Israelites and says, I will work you harder than my father was. So, King Solomon worked them very hard as whips and Rehoboam said, Ha, huh, my father has done it with whips. I will do with scorpions. So he's going to work up twice as hard as his father did. So Israel didn't like that. That's why he only had two tribes. But he also had Jerusalem and the temple of the Lord within his household. So that never left David's family. That stayed in David's family. But Jeroboam had ten tribes. And this is why I don't understand it in first Kings chapter twelve, starting in verse twenty five all the way to the end. Um, since they couldn't go worship the Lord at the temple, King Jeroboam had two golden calves created and had all and had had Israel worship these two golden calves. Now, if you remember during Moses' time, this is exactly what the, this is exactly what they did. They had, they had, a, they made a golden calf and worshipped the golden calf while Moses was on Mount Sinai. Well, Moses destroyed that and God opened up the earth and swallowed those people and said, I am a jealous God. Do not do this. So I'm wondering, the people who are linking the below, could we discuss this and understand why did God allow ten tribes of Israel to worship a false god? That's what I don't understand. He allowed them to worship two golden calves instead of going to Jerusalem and worship the one and only true God of Israel. So, I want to understand that. So, um, that's what I find interesting in this. So, I hope you guys have a good day. Blessed day. Love you guys. And... This is where the adventure starts. So love you guys.